Good girl. Yes, water's gone down quite a bit. Oh, and there's a jump, look. <laughs> oh, dear. Bella's doing her power walk. I can feel it really driving from a hind end, as opposed to Apollo's tr uh, walk, which is really long and jiggly. Hers is pushing from behind, just um, not long strides, but pushing. Walk. She's a little bit strong now in the hand. She is um, pulling with her mouth on the bit. She's stretching her head forward and down in this case, but she's stretching her head forward and uh, obviously wanting to go on. And we're not going on, we're just going to walk nicely up here till we get to a good spot where there's no stones. Good girl. And trot. No, don't be pulling your head down, Bella. No, Bella. Stop that. We're going nicely at trot, that's all. Dalek upside down, but she hasn't noticed. <laughs> or it hasn't bothered her, one or the other. And walk. That's good, girl. Yes, good. It's nice to be able to let her reins out and her not to jog on or trot on or canter on. Good girl, Bella. And you can see she's dropped her neck. Good girl. Good girl. Walk though, walk. Good girl. No, walk. Walk, just walk, Bella. Good girl. Good girl. Head and neck are nicely down. That's good. Yes, good girl. I think this must be the longest time. She's walked on a loose rein with her head and neck at a really good angle down, sort of long and low. Good girl, Bella. I think she's fairly confident. I think that's I think that's maybe why she's starting to do it now. I think she's perhaps more confident in having her reins loose. She she's confident in herself whereas before she had a, she felt she needed a little a little contact with me I think even though she's always been a fairly confident mare brave from the word go really once she'd got over the early start where she had to fight for food and she was thin and 
not very happy because she was all itchy and everything. Once she, once she came to us and then just sort of settled down, yes, we had some battles because she was very headstrong, which she still is headstrong and uh, wants her own way. But I think the more we do together, I think the less that will be a factor. I'm sure that she will shortly settle down to her menage work. Because she will find that she is... I, I'm sure that she'll get great satisfaction in knowing she can do these moves. Because she's very... You know, she's got an aptitude for dressage, really. She just hasn't got the temperament for it, so she's never going to be up there doing uh, Grand Prix dressage. <laughs> Not that she's the right um, build for it, anyway. She's a, a sort of a stubby Andalusian, not not the ones that do make it to Grand Prix level. She's not she's not really that build because she's a bit stubby in a walk and trot. So, yeah, but that doesn't matter, does it, to me? Because there's no way as I'd ever get to Grand Prix level. Yeah, we, best we could hope for would be. Um, Novice. <laughs> that would be the best we could hope for. You walk. Good. She did that on the voice, did you know? She was going to self then. But she did it on the voice. Good girl. You're a good girl, Bella, aren't you? Good girl. Still no rain. No rain contact. Isn't that good? Clever girl. really confident today. Oh, such a pleasure when you've got a confident horse. Walk. Walk. Well done. Good girl, Bella. Good girl, Bella. Good cow. Good cow. If you've enjoyed the video, don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon. We love reading the comments, we love emojis, and we'd love a thumbs up.